A probe by separate arms of the state is underway in relation to the fatal shooting of four men in downtown Kingston on Wednesday morning. Now it is alleged the group of men met their demise after attacking police officers who were responding to explosive outbursts in the area. Here's Natalia Clark. By the look of this, all seems well. Just another day on the bustling streets of downtown Kingston. Except, mere hours ago, this was the scene of a deadly exchange between lawmen and alleged criminals. The police say around 1.30 Wednesday morning, officers responded to deafening sounds of what seemed to be gunshots in the Orange Street area. Went to investigate at which point they were fired on by a group of men. The police returned the fire and the men ran in different directions. Shortly after, a vehicle was seen coming from an open lot in the same vicinity. The men in that motor vehicle are a white eyes open gunfire at the police, resulting in a running gun battle. Superintendent Beres Ford Williams is the commanding officer for the Kingston Central Police Division. He says the chase ended when the vehicle carrying the alleged criminals crashed near the intersection of Charles and King Street. The men alighted from the vehicle, continued firing at the police. The police returned the fire. At the end of the shooting, it, three men were found at the location. A subsequent search of the area resulted in a, in a fourth body being found. The men were found with three 9mm pistols and two M16 rifles were found in their car. Their presence in the area is suspected to be connected to a recent murder. We were in the space with heightened attention because of, some, um, because of a murder that occurred last week. Um, and we have beefed up further the uh, presence in that space. Uh, is the police theorizing or is there any indication that this, you know, the shooting that the police walked into would have been connected to that murder? Or any theories as to what was happening there prior to the arrival of the officers? We highly suspect that it had something to do with that shooting. Superintendent Williams confirms one officer was shot in the altercation and is in stable condition at the hospital. The Independent Commission of Investigation, Indicom, and the Inspectorate Professional Standards Oversight Bureau, IPROBE, is investigating. Natalia Clark, CVM News.